Welcome to This Is Real Real Estate. Hi there, my name is Vong Kennedy and I'm with the Vong Realty Group. In these vlogs, I hope to share with you my journey and experiences as a realtor, buyer, and investor. My goal is to give buyers and sellers first-hand insight into the world of real estate as I navigate through it myself. These vlogs will give you a glimpse into my day-to-day -day happenings as a real estate agent and take you all for a tour of our newest listings. Hopefully, this will help you better understand the buying and selling process and how real estate works. Let's get into it. Hi, welcome to Cove at Waterways at 39 Annie Craig. Come on in. So we just purchased an investment property, a condo here in Etobicoke. Uh, it's a one bedroom, one bathroom, approximately 600 square feet. Just want to give you a tour of our investment property here in Etobicoke. It's our first condo purchase. I'm quite excited about it. Um, the reason we purchased the condo out here is that I think the condo market kind of uh, slowed down a little bit here in the GTA area and I thought I would take advantage of a you know, slower market and purchase at a good time. Eventually, I do feel like the market's gonna correct itself and come back up again, and hopefully it'll be a great investment. What we have here is the full bathroom, um, and then we have your coat closet over here, and you have in-unit laundry, which was very important. So for us, when we were purchasing the condo, a couple of requirements uh, needed to be met for us. Uh, we needed to make sure it had a balcony, it had to have a own parking spot, uh, as well as in-unit laundry. So those were our three requirements. And as an added bonus, this unit actually has, comes with a storage locker as well too. So that's quite nice. Uh, we plan on starting the renovations uh, next week. And then hopefully we can stage, uh, not stage, sorry. So hopefully we can furnish it after that. Some of the renovations that we're planning on doing is I was hoping to do some sort of uh, an accent wall over here, um, along this wall here, because it's a simple unit. I just wanted to add some texture, some dimension to um, the square footage of the condo. So I was hoping to do maybe a textured wallpaper on this wall um, and then continuing the wallpaper to over here just to give these two walls some, uh, an, you know, something different in here. So we're gonna do some wallpaper here as well too. I found a really nice one on Wayfair, like a little textured one. So it's about 600 square feet. This is the kitchen, as you can see. I love white kitchen with white countertops. Uh, the white kitchen here comes with the, uh, came with the appliances when we purchased it. So they're all stainless steel, all full-size appliances, which I really like because they're not your apartment or condo size appliances. So you've got stainless steel fridge, stove, microwave, and dishwasher, so it's handy to have. Although the size of the kitchen is small, I do think it's very functional. There is a, a good, decent amount of counter space and cupboard space as well. Um, I love that it came with under cabinet lighting and the backsplash already. What I'm hoping is to add some open shelving uh, along here. Maybe we could do two or three open shelving, like floating shelves in here, just to add a little bit more storage for the size of the kitchen that we have here. So let's check out the rest of the condo space. So here we are in the main common, uh, main living space of the condo. What I love about this unit is that it's a corner unit. So there's so much natural light. You take the opportunity to have all the extra sliding doors and the windows for you to view here. The, uh, you have a walkout from this area. Either this could be your living room or dining room, however you want to set it up. And then from the bedroom, there's also another walkout as well. We'll check out the view uh, afterwards once we finish our tour. Um, so then, yeah, I was planning on doing the wallpaper along here. My vision also is to, although the space is quite small, when we furnish this for the future tenants, we would like to ha make sure that we have a lot of storage space, as much as possible. So that's gonna be a challenge that we're gonna try to take on is 
figure out how we can incorporate storage with the furniture that we choose to furnish this room. Um, I also think it's important to have some sort of a little office space since you know everybody is working from home so I thought right now things can still change but maybe setting a desk along here then you would have beautiful views uh, as you're working from home as well. Let's go inside to check out the bedroom. So in this bedroom, it's plain, it's simple. Um, what I'm thinking of doing is doing an accent wall here as a focal point. Uh, I saw something on, um, like on Pinterest with a board and batten wall that I think we're gonna try and hopefully it really changes the space of, uh, quite a bit, like transforms it. So again, here from the bedroom, you do have the walkout and all the windows here, which is quite nice. I feel like every corner of this balcony has an amazing view. Let's go check out outside. Let's step outside to have a look at the wraparound balcony. Because it was a corner unit, we were able to take advantage of the wraparound balcony and every view on this balcony is amazing. So this is the walkout from the, uh, the bedroom. You can see here, you've got a beautiful view of the other condos and as well as the city. This view will improve. They are doing construction right now. That's going to be the sister building to this building here. And all the amenities will be there, the swimming pool and all the other amenities will be at that building. So we're super excited to see when that building is completed. <laughs> Say hi, mom and dad. <laughs> This location is amazing. You are minutes away from the Gardener and you're also just min steps away from Lakeshore and beautiful views of Lake Ontario for you to enjoy every day. We're gonna be starting the work on the condo next week and then we'll be furnishing the condo uh, next weekend. So I am excited to bring you back to see the condo once it's all done. <laughs>